Hey, we gang, we back with a video today, man. Hey, I had to show y'all that we moved down. Y'all can see we gained $222 today off of this one. So I jumped in a little early and I was wrong. But we down to $112 only right now. 110 so 105 97 This dropped all the way down to 45 So right now, I just got to find my exit point. Wherever I want to get out. And that's where we'll be getting out at. So I could either... If I still feel that it's going to go down further, I can keep pushing for it to go down further or I can just get out right now and save myself a bigger loss. So I don't know. We're going we're gonna to let it sit for a minute right now. The share price is sitting at $428.79 a share. So we down to $97.95. Let's see if we can run this all the way down real quick, man. But I don't know, though. So we, we finna see, though. We finna see, man. I'll be right back in a few minutes, man. I'm going to update y'all on this next one, man. Let's go. Ahead. But it's still something. That's the main thing. So, I'm going to show y'all how to uh, close out a trade. Here go one that I'm about to close out right now. So, y'all can see this live, man. So, $7 on this one. It ain't much at all, but I'm just doing $8. I'm just taking this one for the purpose to show y'all how to close the trade. So I paid $105 for it. And right now, if I sell it, uh, wait, hold on, sell to close. See, that's what you got to pay attention to. They almost just got me with that one. You got to make sure you paying attention. So they saying my market value is up 10 a day. Minimum credit. So even though I'm up 10 right now, it lost some value from its, uh, basically it's, uh, the price I got in at. So I can just close this one right now so I don't lose any money on this one. Well, I just gained a dollar right now, so I'll sell it now. So let's see if we can get this trade to go through. Okay, so I put an order in to sell that one. Let's see if that one goes through. Now we got this other one that I'm really worried about. This is the one I would like to get out of. Oh, I'm up 70 bucks, 50 bucks. Yeah, we got to get out of this one. We got to get out of this one while we can. Okay. We got to get out of this one while we can, y'all. So you see it's going down right now. It's at 35, 40. So I'm a, I'm a little nervous right now. You know, I don't want to sell it too soon or too late. So I want to be able to make, see, right now it's down to 25, 28, 33, 30, 25, 23. Let's go back over to the chart real quick and see what it's looking like. Okay, so the price is going up right now. So we got to catch this right when it's going back down. So you see how this green bar right here is moving up. We wouldn't want to buy it right here. You, right there, how it just dropped. That's a good time to look at it. So back up to 43. Update. Let's see. Let's see. Do I want to get out right here? Do I want to get out right here? Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I think so, man. I could get 50 bucks. So let's see. If we can hit 50 real quick, I'll jump out. Just to show y'all how this work. 43, 40 is going down. Hopefully it go back up. I really need it to right now. 43, 43, 55. Let's go. We gone. We gone, y'all. You are selling your right to 100 shares. 58. Let's go. It's still going up. Let's see. Let's see. Price still moving. Okay, so you gotta. I gotta get in at a uh, at a price that they willing to sell it for. So one, if I place an order right here, damn. So I'm gonna be up. Damn. See y'all. See how that work. That's why you gotta get out when you can get out. Now I'm back in the negatives. I was just up $50. You got to get out when you can get out. See, I'm used to doing this on my phone, not my laptop. So I might even have to switch over to my phone when it comes to set closing these contracts out because I'm not trying to be losing money like that. 
I didn't like that. So let's see, let's see. I tried see, I tried to close out that other contract. That one didn't work. Now I'm back down. $22 on this one. $12, $27 when I should have just been up $50. So I, yeah, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just close this one out on my uh on my phone. I'm gonna just get it ready to close out on my phone. I got it open here still so y'all can see where it's at, but it's a lot faster if I do it on the phone. So I'm gonna just uh wait right here for the price to go back up. Well actually for the, I'm waiting for the price to drop so I can get out. See, you got to take those little small wins when you can't look. Now I'm down 50. And the price is only going up right now. So I might have just made a big mistake. Which kind of sucks. But, you know, you got to take it one day at a time. Learn from each trade. And you'll get better. So I'm going to turn this back on once. Uh, just get back into positive so that way the video ain't so long. But I'll be right back. You can see we are back up $10 right here. So I'm looking for it to go up kind of any amount really. 20 bucks. 2018. I'm, I'm trying to see if it can go back up to around that, uh, that 40 50 mark. 33 Remember, profit is better than no profit. Yeah, here we go. We at 45 40 35 Damn, I should have just jumped out right there at 40 Touch 40 again, I'm out. And that's how I keep playing with you. Sometimes you just got to get out. Okay, there we go. We out. 40. 40, 43. Okay, I got to redo it. 38. 40. Let's see, let's see. Okay, let's see if we pushed it through at 630. Got it through. 40 bucks. So you see it just disappeared. See, it just say I sold it. So I sold it for six thirty. I bought it for five eighty five. So as you can see, this is fifteen plus this thirty. I made forty five dollars off of this trade right here. So that was a forty five dollar trade y'all just seen. So let's see if I can get out this other trade real quick. Let's see if this is a good spot. So let's see. Uh, so it's one thirteen. I'm up seven dollars for the day, but. I'm down overall because it, it lost some value. So what I'm gonna do is just I'm gonna just sell this one to close it out because I don't want to lose any more money on this one, which is only down about five two dollars actually. Not bad. That's not bad at all. Okay, let's see, let's see where we at. Okay, so I got this. I was just trying to close out this other trade, but I, already, I forgot I already placed the order to close it. So I got to replace the order. Let the price go up. Okay, now I can. Uh, I just canceled that last order. So now I'm selling this one. So you'll just see this one disappear in a second if they accept it. So let's see if they accept that order. So y'all got to see me make $45 on that last trade just from holding it. So this one may be a little difficult. They're not going to accept it right now because the price dropped. So what I got to do is go back, cancel this order, and then replace it. Or just basically replace the order. So I'm just checking between my phone and here real quick, checking out the share price. Okay, so that should disappear. That one gone. So I took about let's see, what did I sell it for? 106. So I paid 105 for this one, sold it for 106, but it lost about five dollars in value. So I probably lost about five dollars on that one. But I'm happy about that first trade. I got out of there profitable. 
that's what it's about finding those good entry points and getting out at the right spots so that's it for this video uh, I might get into a trade today that I'll show y'all make sure you hit the subscribe button turn on notifications like button share the video all that A1 gang we out